What's going on gang? This is it. This is the first profit diary entry from myself. Uh, Carrie will probably give you one a little bit later. Um, but this is how it's going to flow. It's budget as you want. I told you it weren't going to be a vlog yesterday. So it's going to be set on an iPhone. Might even have to go and buy a selfie stick to make it that little bit more professional. But um, yeah, so everything's going to be pretty, pretty budget. But the training and the approach we take into the World OCR Championships is going to be pretty good. So stay tuned. This is it. So <laughs> this is my little part of the vlog just to um, let you guys know what I'll be doing today. So I've finished work, had a few clients this morning, just on my way down the park with the kids at summer holidays. So trying to work the training around that, it's been a little bit tough, but uh, the plan tonight is to go to Rob and Justine's and do the rig and run session. So uh, a good grip session on their rig and a bit of running as well. T Rob. Train OCR the OCR guru. Train the trainers. Train the trainers. Rob, talk me through the session, mate. Right, we'll do a little mini rig. We'll start with the, the rep bag, because it's got an egg with it at the moment. Then we'll do the farmer's carry, up and overs, tire pulling. It's looking pretty mean, I see a lot of runs. Stairway to heaven, rope climb, monkey bars, then a run. Then we'll come back, and then we're on the rigs again. So, let me just explain. So basically, OCI, as you know, well, me and uh, Kerry are going to be off to the World Championships. It's an endurance-based sport. It does involve a lot of technical stuff, a lot of grip, a lot of upper body strength, and also a little bit of function movement, crawls and carries. So this is where it happens on a Friday evening. This is one of my first sessions here. As you can tell by my, my delivery, I'm a little bit out of breath. But these are the gang that are going to Worlds. So yeah, it's all good, it's happening. Saying Kez. Don't make me talk to the camera. Saying Kez. Die. Kerry, you can't just bail out. Oh. It's video diaries. Well. It doesn't matter. I ain't going to vote. It's, it's, not, going, it's not going to vote, Kez. <laughs> trash, <laughs> trash hands. Not mine or worse. Nearly there, nearly across it. What you got to improve on, Kez? Uh, the last part of this rig, nunchucks. Nunchucks. How about having a night in your garden? What's your running saying? So I'm on the way into the gym, it's like family day on a Saturday. I have my brother-in-law, my cousin, and one of my pals. So I get them done, I'll probably stay in the gym for an extra hour, have a little stretch out. Hands are a little bit sore from last night to be fair, but that was, uh, that was the way it's gonna be. Uh, leads us into tomorrow, not much going on today. It's an easy day for me. Morning gang, it's Sunday morning, half marathon day, little training event. Just sorting out some breakfast. This one's big. Big. And here it is. Nutella banana porridge. Chop up the banana, it's the best way to eat it, right? Chop up the banana, throw it in, and put it in the bottom, and you just dig the, the banana. I literally have only about four or five mouthfuls, and that is for me. We're here. Sunday morning, what's the time? Quarter past nine. On our way to Penfield to go for a nice long run. All in prep. So Henfield half complete, 21 k's. It's a good training for Canada. It's going to be about 15 k, uh, but obviously it's going to be a little bit more hilly than that. Conditions are warm. Let's catch up with Kerry. See what she's saying. Drinking loads of water. I'm so thirsty. Saying, mate. Oh, yeah. I had about four of these. <laughs> Feel strong? Got heavy dizziness. Just waiting for Jay now. Just waiting for Jay to come through. So Jay's finished, just crossed the line. Let's have a look, Jay. Oh. Tasty. Tasty. <laughs> Hot day, half marathon. What's this one saying? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hi 
nice bath done. Um, obviously getting the miles in, we've got to look after recovery, which is probably just as important as the training. So now for me, it is food time and chill. <laughs>